The ToolPro 8A300 commercial drywall cart is a quick, efficient, and easy option to move drywall around the job site. It's going to come with everything you need in the box to assemble it, and it's about 20% cheaper than our competitors, which makes it an impressive value. From left to right, you're going to see everything you need to assemble the actual cart itself. You have two swivel and two locking casters, as well as the hardware to mount them. You have six bolts with nylock nuts, as well as washers to mount the main hoop and the support arms. You have an instruction sheet, and then you have the main frame of the commercial cart itself. The first step in assembly is going to be making sure all your parts are here. You're going to have two components to the main hoop, two support arms, the main frame itself, all four of these casters, as well as these six bolts, and 16 nuts, washers, and lock washers. Once you identify everything, make sure it's all on the box, you're going to take the two main sections of the, of the hoop, And you'll notice this one in my left hand has a spring clip and the one in my right hand has a corresponding hole in the bottom of it. So you're going to make them up next to each other, like so, press the button in, and they're going to lock together. Once you've got that panel, drop them both down on these circular pegs on the frame. And drop it down into place. All right, so the next step is we're going to want to mount this main hoop down to the mainframe. You're going to want to grab both your wrenches as well as two pieces of your long hardware. Take one of the nuts off. And a washer. Drop the bolt through like so. Put a washer on. And just get it finger tight. All right, next step is we're going to want to put the support arms on here. Remember, everything's just finger tight right now. So grab one support arm. Take a nut loose. Grab yourself a washer off there. Line her on up. Let it hang. Put your washer on. As well as the nut. And we're just going to move that same step over to this side. Take one nut washer off. Washer on. Nut on. Once again, just finger tight. <clears throat> Alright, now we have all six of the mounting bolts placed and finger tight. You're going to want to go back behind with the two included wrenches and just tighten everything up. Get everything nice and snug. This is where you're going to make sure that this cart is as strong as it can be. Now that everything's all tightened up, we're going to move on to the casters. So like I said before, you have two locking and two swivel casters. So what you want to do is mount the two locking ones on the same short side and then the two swivel ones on the other short side. And that gives you the versatility to have a fully moving cart or one that swivels about two wheels. So I'm actually going to get these started, and I think we're going to probably time lapse this because it's going to make it a lot easier to watch. Um, but essentially, all you have here is a rectangle pattern, and then you're going to take the hardware, drop the stud through from the top, use the lock washer and flat washer on uh, the nut side, tighten everything up, get everything finger tight, and then come back with a wrench and tighten everything up permanently. And then by the time you see this cart next time, It'll be all finished and ready to roll. The TP8A300 drywall card comes in a flat pack box, which makes it easy to get to the job site where you can assemble it and use it as needed. The casters are durable, hardened rubber on a cast iron wheel, and as we've said, they are you do have two locking casters as well as two swivel casters. You can fit 24 sheets of half-inch drywall on the 12-inch load deck. It's powder coated in an easy to spot yellow color. It's small four factor makes it easy to maneuver and the rounded corners keep you from banging up your ankles.